Hey, what's up everybody? This is Royce and Pedal Mel. Welcome to my channel. Uh, tonight's video is going to be reviewing this Jada Toys Scooby-Doo Mystery Machine with Shaggy and Scooby-Doo. And I have my daughter here. She wants to, since this is technically for her, see, hi, say hi, Violet. <laughs> so we're going to open this up and we will take a close look at it and grab my knife. Some of it's still got some tabs here on there. All right, so we'll go ahead here. Yes, I'm going to peel the uh, Well, just wait, just wait, just wait. Here, hold on. There's a whole probably thing we need to do here with this to get this out. Uh, probably going to have to cut the other side, too. Well, let's just see here what, what we have to do to unbox this. Well, you know. I don't know. You said those marks were already on there, but here's the box. We'll show you the box to everybody first. Not really much going on there. I do like the the uh the rest of the box looks pretty pretty good but it doesn't really say much if the figures were die cast metal i thought maybe that the figures were die cast metal but they're not they uh, appear to be vinyl yeah they're vinyl plastic yeah vinyl plastic the figures and can i get scooby out yeah but let me let me let me see here once i can help you mm -hmm. i can get the last plate out to get that off see it's got the metal the metal twisty tie there. I know you're anxious. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> he is cute. So there's Scooby, right? There's Scooby, and then we have Shaggy, but he's screwed Aww. down. So we'll get that off, and then we'll dismount the van, and I'll put it on the turntable. Coming. Why do they need to do two screws for a little vinyl figure is beyond me. But what do I know? I'm just a dummy. Just kidding. Don't call yourself that. See, that's what I say you do. You don't call yourself names. Why do they have two screws, though, in for Shaggy? This is really stupid. Stupid. All right. So, you know what? He is metal. He is metal with vinyl. With uh, vinyl. He is metal? Yeah, he has vinyl plastic arms, but the body is definitely metal. That's why they have him screwed to the base with two screws. It's, it's got some weight too. That's like the Batman and Robin figures I had were metal. So he is, he's all plastic, right? Yeah, he's all plastic. So let's get the van off of here, which I can see already five minutes into you playing with this, those mirrors will probably be broken off. That's okay though, as long as the whole yeah, thing isn't. I don't, thing is I don't really care, but it's your toy. You can do what you want with it. Uh, this screwdriver is not really working very well. I need the screw stripped out. Here it comes. It's freaking frustrating. Then you got one of the screws out. Like, can they make it any more annoying for you to get out of a package? Oh my lord. Alright, so here we go. We have the mystery machine van up on the turntable, and we have a shaggy and scooby figurines next to it. I believe this is supposed to be 124 scale. It doesn't say here anywhere on the box that I could find. Uh, I would say it's 124 scale. If you're not familiar with that, it's basically the the van is probably six inches or so, maybe seven inches, and uh, it is die cast metal. And we will open the doors up on it here. Uh, paint looks pretty decent on it. Has my own dog inside. I don't know what's going on with this door here. It's about ready to fall off. Compared to the other side, it seems really, wow, that is really sloppy, the door. All right, so here we'll give, Ma no, just ran off with the figures. We'll try to get, she's laughing in the background. It's like dealing with a monkey. So there we have some detail in there, and there's a, uh, looks like a shift on the column, a shift lever here for, like the old vans, you would shift on the, col on the column. I remember my father's plumbing van was like that. But the paint, as you can see in this shot, is not bad. It looks like a little bit of orange peel there. You can, re I mean, that's nitpicking, obviously, for the cost that this is. But in the uh, tampos, or I'm not sure what the decal process is on the side. It looks really well done on this. It does have removable rubber tires or synthetic rubber tires with orange centered rims. Uh, this is plastic in the front, the uh, spare tire. The mirrors, I could see them probably breaking off in no time. 
Uh, passenger door is not as loose as the as the driver's side. Not much going on underneath, but the like uh, Vile pointed out earlier in the video that the back unfortunately does not open up. Which I wish it did. Yeah, this is really really pathetically loose though here. I'm not sure what's going on with that. If that's something I could fix, but it feels like the door's gonna fall off any second. <laughs> And this was not, I should say, this was not very cheap because I got this off of eBay and the price was semi-reasonable, but after paying shipping and everything, uh, it was not cheap. I think it was like $30 maybe total. I'm not sure, $30, $35. It wasn't cheap by any means. For what here, let's put the figures back up on here and we could have him like he's getting into climbing in. But see, they don't fit in there, Violet, so... Uh, I don't think that's going to work. Yes, they do. <laughs> Not really. And I think, can you, does it open in the back there or is it plastic? Oh, it's just plastic. So you can't stick them in the back or anything. You got to be very careful with this door though, honey, okay? I won't. You have to be, you won't be careful. I know. <laughs> is that what you're saying? Great. All right, step back a little bit so everybody can see the actual thing that we're trying to film. Do you see the screen right here? This is what we're trying to film. All right, let's just not do that because you're going to damage everything. Because I'm pretending to Here, let's just sit them beside and we'll spin around some more and then he <laughs> Scooby on the roof. Maybe better put down here so everybody can see him though. But he looks pretty good. I don't know if did I show that. I see your face there, but <laughs> it looks pretty good. It has the SD there on the his little dog tag but let's let's put it over here let's spin it around one more time okay. all right so there we go with the jada toys 124 scale scooby-doo mystery machine and if you like this type of video be sure to give me a thumbs up share like subscribe all that good stuff if you're not a subscriber to the channel i have all kinds of diecast related stuff and some other how-to videos for actual one-to-one -one scale vehicles and that kind of stuff uh, if you're not a subscriber, be sure to hit the bell for notifications, and I will see you guys next time.